Hey, Brent and Amanda, good afternoon, everyone. Yeah, here at Bunnell today, things got a little hairy around 8.30 this morning, students told us. And police made a point to let us know in a press conference just after noontime that they don't believe the 11th grade boy who stabbed himself ever had any intention of harming anyone else. But they pointed out that students and staff quick reaction made sure that was the case. During first period inside Bunnell High School, students say they heard school staff running the halls yelling lockdown. The school's phone system and internet were down at the time, so no PA system. I mean, at first I thought that someone like got into the school and like I was like kind of like scared at first. But it was a case of self-harm inflicted by a junior male student who stabbed himself during a class. Once he was actually um, injured himself um, with the aid of the teacher who is EMS trained, uh, medical protocols went into place and it just became a medical situation at that point. And students also acted quickly by alerting the school nurse. Certainly that teacher was quite heroic at the time and should feel good about the way he handled things. The injured student transported to Bridgeport Hospital, where he was listed in stable condition as of mid-afternoon. It's always a sad time when a student uh, does anything that's self-harm, and we are all concerned about that, and we are concerned about our other students and our staff. Bunnell students tell Fox 61 the individual stabbed himself in front of an ex-girlfriend. For us, it's too early in the investigation for me to say, because again, we haven't even had a chance to speak um, with the individual. And one of the students said social media posts were making fun of the situation, which she took exception with. It's like important because it's like his mental health and like that's what, and it's not right. Counseling services being made available until 8 p.m. tonight all day tomorrow and all day Friday again till 8 p.m. to student staff and teachers right here at Bunnell. We're live in Stratford, Tony Terzi, Fox 61 News. All right, Tony, thank you.